what is everybody? So it's you here back with another video today with a Minecraft tutorial and today we're going to be learning how to install Optifine and shaders on your Mac in uh, Minecraft 1.16 and first thing you're going to need to do is make sure you install Java so just go ahead you know I'm not even probably not even going to drop a link just uh, look for Java on uh, Google and you can find that now Optifine is just a website now on a Mac you're going to want to go ahead and download the mirror version and uh, it is in snapshot form, whatever, that's okay. It's gonna work on the official release of 1.16. Now, if it doesn't download it first, go back and then try it again, and uh, it should save. So I put it on the desktop. Now, uh, what may happen for you is uh, you're gonna get, need to go ahead and go to security privacy in your settings and then uh, press open anyway. Uh, you're gonna have to uh, go through the lock to change or whatever sometimes but so you're gonna go ahead and do that since this is a third party application of course it's not defined so it's fine uh, then you're gonna want to go ahead and download your shaders now in order for, to install the shaders at first you're gonna need to run Minecraft with Optifine uh, on it so uh, for the version uh, you have it on uh, at least once and then you can throw the shaders in there so pretty simple stuff uh, now I also found out you have to install Optifine or at least have that on your desktop um, or wherever you save it so I'm just going ahead and downloading the shaders but uh, you need to have Optifine for each single version you want and then you need to uh, install that every single time that you want to switch versions so I will, like on 1.16 I had Optifine then I needed to download 1.8 Optifine when I wanted to go uh, to that so uh, we're gonna go ahead and load up the game before we can uh, install these shaders now you're gonna get the shaders uh, selection there so now when you go to Minecraft uh, application support you're gonna do that by going clicking go on the top uh, of your screen and then you're gonna go ahead and uh, press alt or option on your keyboard that's gonna bring in uh, the library then you're gonna go application support Minecraft and then you'll find the shaders after you run it now what you're gonna want to do is throw uh, your slide or your shaders in there and uh, for the uh, Silders one or whatever it's called, I needed to create a new folder just called, uh, I, just, I called it Silders. Now they came unzipped uh, for me. Now they may not, they may come in zip format for you. Just go ahead and unzip those. And if it doesn't work, you're going to troubleshoot a little bit. So I went Silders on this. And then what you need to do is throw the shaders, that folder, in there. And then uh, you're good to go. Now actually what I did wrong in that situation is I didn't rename that to just shares it needs to be that that folder inside the top folder the shell folder needs to be just shaders so you're gonna see here now it's shaders and now silders will pop up in the shaders uh, thing so first we had I think uh, BC I think the, I don't know whatever one this one doesn't work for some reason I don't know about that but I know silders work so does project Luma if we hop into Project Luma real quick, you can see for me, my computer is really laggy. Uh, my Mac is not exactly built like that. So, uh, yeah. And then if we go to, so you can see here, just application support at, and from the library. And then you eventually make it to Shares Packs. I went ahead and downloaded the light version, which worked a lot better for me. I can actually get close to 60 FPS, uh, which I know isn't a whole lot for Minecraft, but uh, it's at least operable at that point. So, uh, now, at the beginning, it was really bad, but then I, I, tweak, I tweaked the settings a lot, so you may need to do that depending on uh, your computer configurations but uh yeah really excited to actually have uh, shaders on my uh, computer I've always want to do that but uh yeah so hopefully this did help you out i know i ran really fast uh, rewatch everything if you do need to uh, go through it but uh it's pretty simple and pretty easy so now and then all those sliders that you or shaders should be uh good and good to go and in there now we just went ahead and went to a different one and you can also add texture packs on top of that but anyway guys i'll see you on the next one peace